Three riders, one rental car, 4,000 kilometers, one Japan. After 500 hours on Google Earth, the crew was armed with a map of the legendary drifting spots of Initial D. In the road ahead lies epic skylines, ancient temples, and tons of weird food. The adventure begins in Tokyo, the most populated city on Earth. Shibuya Crossing was pretty crazy. Apparently it's the busiest pedestrian intersection in the world, and I believe it, man. As soon as the lights go, it's just a sea of people just all crossing each other. Food was awesome, and it was really cool that you could just take whatever you wanted, and it was just there instantly. Each plate is worth a different amount of money, and so depending on what plates you have on your table, that's how much it costs. Kind of how the arcade works, how it seems to me, is it kind of gets people to start young, and it goes up every floor in maturity, and then at the very top there's gambling. Oh. <laughs> what is that? It's supposed to be kind of like a uh, cockpit, as if you were manning the machine, and uh, yeah, you just fight other robots. <laughs> kind of just study the road as you go up and make sure there's no hazards, yeah. And other things that we're looking for are potholes, cracks, really really bad sections of pavement just so we know where they are and we're ready for them or we can avoid them so we're not going to crash. First of all it was nighttime and all I could think about was how steep it was and like how intimidating it looked in the night. I was kind of scared. I'm like wow I'm skating this tomorrow. There was drift marks all over the pavement. I don't know if there's going to be drifters on the road. How many hairpins are we at now? 85. <laughs> We went down 48 hairpins and didn't see a single car on my first run. There were uh, tire tracks, so uh, that was definitely a telltale sign that there were drifters everywhere. Halfway, I was like, wow, my legs are already extremely tired. I'm gonna skate the rest of this. <laughs> we noticed that there's a bunch of drift marks going onto this one side road, this little offshoot. So it's like, well, there's a bunch of drifters going onto this road. It's probably a pretty good windy road. Halfway down, there's this tunnel with two hairpins inside. It's the second you start turning in the tunnel, you're losing traction. It wants to push you out. I couldn't believe like that I was skating through a tunnel like with two drifting corners inside of the tunnel. Hi guys, thanks for watching the Rain Skyline Tour. Click here for the next episode. Click here for this episode's blog post and see what boards we wrote in Japan. Please like and subscribe and we'll see you next time.